Hello everyone. In this topic, uh, we will discuss about the cancer, breast cancer prediction. So, here is our data. We I will share uh, go from of the Jupyter for notebook file, so you can see uh, data file here CSV format. So some summary of the uh, how to uh, cancer. Uh, will be breast cancer will be found in our body so first of all discuss about the uh, cells out of uh, begin of control growth is out of control so then he did, he will be detected in the x-ray machine so let us start uh, how to solve the problem to predict accurate 98 uh, percent detection of the uh, breast cancer prediction so let's let's start uh, first of all i'm going to my directory here you can see the data file i will show you uh, which format will be data uh, create so you just open the file in the exit so you can see id diagnose radius maximum minimum mean a lot of data will be here you can see here is the medical data healthcare data so let's start we are going to the directory document folder cd youtube ls here just simple run uh, jupyter notebook if you cannot install jupyter notebook Go to you if install use this command Jupyter. Okay, I have already in the, my Jupyter notebook, so I'm using Python 3.8. So you can see also uh, the version of the Python. So let's start Jupyter notebook here. Uh, open the Jupyter notebook in local. We can also use the Colab. Uh, so Google platform it's open for the GPU base. If you and uh, you have not any GPU, so you can also use the uh, Google Colab. Here our load data and here is our file. We can go to the Jupyter notebook and uh, case study file of the predict breast cancer. So here is some theory about the study case study just uh, clicking here so you can uh, read it read it out uh, how we will discuss already discuss where how to uh, deck the uh, deck, uh, breast cancer out of cells controlling out of cells so uh, he he will found in male female babies so on so let's see here are the sign of the breast cancer. You can see the uh, names with names. So you read out these names. So we will detection of the K nearest classification. So here is the classification of the algorithm. You can see uh, where data get from. You can also see the uh, American uh, Cancer Society tested. So here I will mention the all links in file where in the source code and the source file get from uh, breast cancer data. Uh, let's start how to uh, work in algorithm. So let's see. Here general loaded libraries. So you can install all libraries from SKLand, NumPy, Sigon, and Metaplotdiff, Pandas. First of all, I'll install libraries, then load data. So I am running my loaded files library. You can see that I am also running load data file. Then initialize analysis. 
just run this command and you can see the data excel data get from here now you can see all the parameters mentioned then you can also mention the uh, project uh, data info data share data project columns name you can see also list of the column i am trying to run one by one so you can see explore data in the plot side you can see the male and baby so here is the graph and the mention block m and b diagnosis then numeric column of the you already mentioned one by one column name row name and so on here the our uh, column graph check out one by one here the radius mean extra mean parameter mean area mean so computer mean connect mean here you can see the all means here will be shown and show the final uh, picture then uh, correlation so here the analyzing of the correlation uh, between all data sets you can see the picture of the correlation ship taking to time here data processing and pipeline you also can see we run this file and also this file and then numeric file yeah you can see the correlation between the uh, mean and radius mean and column mean then data process pipeline here we can also running this this pipelines then generic method of the model uh, preparation model you can see also the function of the preparation models yeah predict the model of the uh, classification 99 percent k nearest uh, classification 95 percent so uh, i will put here the last summary so you can see a classification for relationship yeah report how much accuracy and uh, weight and so on so the down okay and here is classification correlation graph here the last summary of the model how much accuracy and uh, score so uh, credit goes to the kegel and uh, can see i hope uh, helpful for the breast cancer analyzer 99% accuracy uh, eda platform so uh, i hope this is help for the uh, lot of people for prediction this uh, data sets so if you get from data i will share you the link of the data sets and uh, this algorithm hope you like it Please support our channel for more getting information and updates.